Hi, this is Sridhar. This is the last session of the grep command in Unix shell scripting. Here uh, we'll be discussing about hyphen h option. Basically, before I uh, I said that if you are searching for the pattern in multiple files, that is file star.txt or star.txt, then by default the file name will be displayed. File name will be displayed. See. For example, let me type a new command. I grep and I'm grepping for pattern line in file star.txt. Grepping for the word pattern line in file star.txt. If you put if you enter multiple files, then the file name will be included in the result. But if you wish, if you don't want to include file name, then you can use hyphen h option hyphen small h it won't print the file name and sometimes if your output didn't display your the file name then you can give hyphen capital H there are two options one is hyphen caps capital H and hyphen small h hyphen capital H it will display the file name and hyphen small h it won't display the file name If you see grep the line file.txt it's displaying the output but there is no file name because here you are giving only single file only if you enter multiple files then only the file name will be preceded to each to all the output but here if we are gi since we are giving only a single file file name the name of the file will not be included but i want to include the name of the file in that case what you can do simply you can give iphone H capital H. Now we will get the result by including the file name as well. Okay, but if you are putting it as grep line file star dot txt, means it's checking for the pattern line for multiple files. Multiple files means it's searching for more than one file. So in that case, by default, it will print the file name. The first one will be the file name. But here, if you wa don't want to print the file name, if you don't want to print the file name, even if you use multiple files for the given search pattern, then what you can do, simply you can give iPhone H, that is small h. Here, even if you are giving multiple files for searching the pattern line, the file name will not be displayed here. If you give small h, capital H is for printing the file name and iPhone small h is for it won't print the file name the next one is iPhone q iPhone q means quiet or silent gripping it will check whether the pattern is found or not if it found then it won't display the result just it will it won't display anything it won't display anything iPhone q searching for the pattern line in file 2.txt it won't display anything if you want to know the status whether it is success or not then you have to check it by using echo dollar question mark echo dollar question mark means it will display the exit status whether it is success or not zero means success and non-zero anything other than zero means failure if you see here yes the exit status is zero so it is success if you give it as qwasd this pattern is not found in file 2.txt even in that case it won't display anything but you can see the result by putting echo dollar question mark so the st status is failure it didn't find the search pattern as i written here it will not write anything to the standard output it will exit immediately with the zero status if the match is found and non zero if the match is not found if the pattern is pattern is not found it will not it will not display any error message as well it will not display anything and the next one is suppressing the error message suppressing the error message see here i am searching for the pattern line but i am using the iphone s option and my input file is file 2.tx file 2.tx is not present the actual file name is file 2.txt but i am giving it wrongly as file 2.tx it will s even in this case it won't sh tell you that file name didn't found or wrong file name invalid file name anything nothing it will be displayed so it will suppress the error message it won't display the 
error message let me check the exit status exit status also failure 2 if you put correctly then it will display the result it will display the result and exit status is also 0 so iPhone s means iPhone s will work only if there is an error only if there is an error it will suppress printing the error message it won't display the error message and the next one is grep iPhone X X means the pattern is the entire line the pattern is the entire line so if you are searching for the pattern I am searching for the pattern end but this end is a entire word not the one entire line not the word entire line for the entire line itself only end is present so in that case you can give iPhone X option so it will display end if you remove you can compare by removing this one grep simply end 52.txt you got the result there are three lines but in all the three lines end is not the complete line end is not the end means the pattern the pattern end is not the complete line here you have the pattern but it follows with some other words here also the pattern is found but also it followed by some other words but only in for this line the pattern is found and this is the entire line the pattern itself is the entire line in that case it will display the result so iPhone X is for printing the pattern which match the entire line and you can also put write some regular expressions in the grep command here let me execute separately grep iPhone I PL SQL in file 2.txt here I have the pattern PL SQL but in the second line I am using small lowercase and uppercase mixedly so if you are using if you if you are not using iPhone I option then it won't display the second line so if you want to use if you want to print the second line also and you want to use the regular expression then you can give it in square brackets as I said earlier the square brackets means it will return only a single digit or single character here I am putting P capital P and small p so it will return any one one value either capital P or small p and L means either capital L or small l and within square bracket yes capital S or small s so it will result it will return only a single character so I am putting all these PL SQL inside separate square brackets so I am searching for the PL SQL in the in input file file2.txt there we got it PL SQL and this PL SQL also displayed you can use iPhone I option also but in some case you need this regular expression so you need to know about the regular expression also here the, in the regular expression you can also put star Ast that is asterisk symbol question mark anything anything you can put it and that's all about the grep command we will discuss about some other topic in the next session thanks for watching bye